So something really cool happened to me on Christmas and I just wanted to share it with you guys. I think this is the first time me and my husband had like had this moment where I verbalized one of the triggers that I was having. And I wasn't like really triggered, but it was just like a memory that I had. So I was uh, cooking us Christmas dinner and it was, you know, a moment where he was in his office setting up Xbox that I got him for Christmas. And he was, you know, just chilling, just vibing, doing his thing. I was like, hey babe, I'm having a little bit of, you know, some allergies. Do you think you could bring me some Sudafed just because I'm not feeling the best? And uh, dinner will be ready here in about 10 minutes. He was like, sure, babe. Yeah, I absolutely can do that for you. I'll grab you it. And, and he goes to step over the dog gate that we currently have because we got a new kitty. And as he goes to step over it, he hits his knee and he lets out this audible yell. And I was like, oh my God, what just happened? Well, I go into the office, he's laying on the ground. And like for a second there, my heart just like immediately starts pounding because first of all, I'm like, is he okay? Like what the heck just happened? And I realized that what happened that he hit his knee, I immediately was like, oh no, he's about to get mad. He's gonna yell at me. This is gonna be my fault. Instead of getting mad, he just looks down and he's like stupid knee. I can't believe I did that. And he started laughing. I started na laughing like nervously because I was like, <laughs> uh, <laughs> and he was like, babe, you're right. I was like, um, you know, I'm just like low key, like, you know, not triggered, but I just like have like a wild memory through all of this. And he goes, was that wild memory just like being prepared that I was going to scream and yell at you because and say that it was your fault because I tripped and fell. I wasn't paying attention to where I was going. Is that the memory that you had? And I just kind of looked at him for a second and I was like, how did you know that? Like, how did you know that's what was going on just now? And he just laughed and he was like, because I know how much of a POS your ex is or your exes or anybody in your life was. And I just know that that's the type of thing that they would get mad at you about. And no, baby, it's absolutely not your fault. It's okay. It's my fault. I wasn't paying attention to what I was doing or where I was going. And my leg is longer than the universe and I tripped and fell. It's not your fault. And you know, I just thought that was really cool. And because obviously like we've had really good moments like that before, but just being in a relationship with someone, being in a healthy relationship with someone who just gets it and understands and is reassuring and doesn't throw it back into my face anytime something happens where I'm like having a memory or if I was like actively triggered or anything, he just genuinely understood where I was coming from and like why I felt the way that I did. So I say all this to say that I genuinely hope that you guys find someone that will be just as understanding and loving and caring when something happens that's not your fault, but a result of something that you asked of them to do for you. And I hope you guys can find that too, cause I love it here.